would like to welcome to call back to Castlevania Order of Ecclesia. This guy is gonna get fired because he doesn't write any sports stories. Sure, he makes the sales, but. <sighs> Why do I have a sports magazine in an area that lives near Dracula with monsters? You'd think you would shift your focus to something that doesn't involve a sport that can't have demons everywhere. Hey there. Thanks for getting rid of those quotes. Eclair. I love a good eclair. Those things are tasty! Mmm! How can you say no to an eclair? What monster are you? Completing those quests at the speed of sound! Aw, oh, man! Really? The tartar. I don't like tartatans. They're gross. Oh, that! Oh, oh no, no fruit tartan. Okay, no, 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 they're not gonna grow. Thought I was talking about those uncooked buns. Oh wow, that actually looks like fruit looks pretty tasty. But I don't like fruit. Fruit can go suck it. So this area is kind of neat. Ignis, once again, kind of saves the day by being very versatile and practical. Where does all this chainsaw fuel come from? <laughs> like, no, seriously, where the hell does all this fuel come from? These guys are not going to survive the oil peak. They're gonna be like, oh man, now I've gotta switch to eco friendly hedge clippers. Man, all these reused assets are kind of making this game a bit bull. Yeah, I'm looking for Evil Force because I thought that Evil Force dropped something. It doesn't. Man, post commentary's been going down the drain lately, hasn't it? Yeah, I, I've been grinding a lot of enemies, which is why I'm such a high level. But it's just mostly to get all the, the drops. Did I say Evil Force is a nice effect? The old glowy thing. Whoop! The more I play this, the more I'm looking forward to uh, Symphony of the Night. Because these castle environments, while they look really bland from a platforming point of view, they're a lot more satisfying to go through. I don't know. Bump on the noggin. I love schnitzel! This stuff is delish. I will not. I will never say no to a schnitzel. Schnitzel. The Z is a T S. That's how German works. I don't know where Vienna lives though. Oh, that's in France. I thought schnitzels were German. Oh, it's boneless meat. 
Oh. What? Oh, Goldor, cool. I need one of those. Oh, it's from Vienna, which is in Austria. Yeah, that, that makes more sense. Damn. I just love schnitzel. This stuff's delish. I like them nice and flat. Mmm. Look at all these guys. It's very limited enemy selection. Enemy selection, isn't there? Eh. I'm fine with it, because they're pretty cool. And I need the Kashmir. I, I I grind the Kashmir before the next video. It actually gets me two levels, so don't be surprised next time. Kashmir doesn't get you a good dress, though. Uh, the quest word is pretty shit. It's a dress that gives you... I think it gives me four more points of defense and lowers some of my int and mind, which is kind of terrible when you think about it. Oh, man. Why isn't the Netherlands on this list? Anyway. This makes me sad, because I freaking love it's so delish. I'm also super sad I can't play... Bloodborne. I'm not gonna shut up about that, by the way. I'm gonna keep saying that until I have a PS4 and Bloodborne, or until I forget. And if I remind myself, I never forget. NEVER FORGET! So yeah, this area is just really dark, because guess what it's at the end! I really like this. I like this conceptually. Um, it is a bit annoying and mind-bending, but hey, it's pretty cool. It, it's, it's they do that cool thing again with the glyphs. It take a lot of hits, though. Oh, man. Cordon Bleu. It's pretty tasty, Cordon Bleu. You should try that. On an, on any meat. It's just deli It's pretty nice. It's a nice twist. Huh. Didn't know chicken fingers were practically schnitzels. But yeah! Um... Yeah. So, uh... Someone better send me a PS4 and Bloodborne and a new version of the Elgato. <laughs> that would be hilariously expensive. Especially shipping. That's gonna weigh some. It's gonna be expensive. Nah, I'm fine. I just complain a lot, and usually I get over it. Or I fix the problem. And I buy it. Sending myself years into debt. Nah, I'll get over it. I'll learn to accept the fact. Yeah, this one's actually pretty cool. Um, you can only fire a few of them at a time, which is kind of annoying, and they're short-ranged. But they deal a lot of damage. They're very good at hurting things. I don't know if I'll use them against Albus, though. I don't know. It depends on how the fight goes. I will annoy you. Get me blood born right now. Wait, I'm not doing it in the rhythm. Wah -wah. You can't convince people with annoyance to do something for you that they shouldn't need to feel obliged to do by singing out of rhythm. That's not how it works. Man, that cheese and ham and a cordon bleu is just delish. Anyway, the video's almost over, so I don't have any time to bitch about stuff that I don't really care about all that much anymore. Like, sure, I want to play it, but usually with Souls games, I hate the game. Except Demon Souls and Dark Souls were fine. Dark Souls 2, I might do the Definitive Edition again, and see if I can give it a fair chance with a non-mage character that might work out. Who knows? And I won't play it at 60 FPS. Otherwise, see you guys next time. I hear a show of Umbra, because Umbra is, is, is kind of better, I'd say, you know, in a sense. It's not worse. It's half damage. It's still pretty... It's a homing attack. It's pretty good. So yeah, see you guys next time. Everything that I need to say has been said right now. In a compact package. All inclusive. See you guys next time. Bye! Man, that's Matt's outro thing.